everybody. This is Kim from Key Diamond Paints. And as you see, I have a couple of things from Amazon I wanted to share with you today. This right here is not a diamond painting, but diamond painting related. So let's open that first. I'm not sure what this is going to look like when we get into it. So there might be some pausing here. But I am really excited about this. When I did... Um, First started diamond painting, and when I did, I you know, I always talk about my 60 by 90. That's like my claim to fame, you guys, my 60 by 90, though. That's why, and I just really whew, had no problems working on those, but now I've started my, um, my photograph, my custom Cuff W key that's uh, 70 by 50, and I am just not enjoying it as much so oh wait it's a box in a box you guys box in a box it's exciting <gasps> do you see what i got myself Ooh. i got a bigger light pad i am very excited about this i have an a4 right now which let me pause you so you don't have to i'll get it for you hold on Okay, here's my A4, and this has a plug in the side, right here, and I have had no troubles with this. This thing is working for me really well, but in the larger size diamond painting, I'm just struggling a little bit this time. I was, I was looking to purchase an A2, actually. Um, but then, because I've seen a couple of YouTubers with A2s, and I thought, well, this is the size that I want, until I saw a comparison, and I realized just how, oh, look at how nicely they packed this. I just, I saw just how big an A2 is, and I thought, you know what, actually, um, that's a little too, that's a little too much. I want bigger, but look at how well this is packed. Look at the one time you're like, oh, bubble wrap, right? <laughs> Every other time it's like, ooh, bubble wrap. This looks, maybe if I flip it over, maybe it's on the back here. Oh, it's just an envelope. It's a bubble wrap envelope. How wonderful. is sturdy okay so it comes with and I'll tell you another um, have my, oh look it comes with clips oh those are pretty strong I don't have any other clips because I have a tiny little a4 why would I need clips and this is just a customer service card saying thank you but these are pretty good and they're pink whatever huh I'll take them very nice I love pink okay let me put those over there so this right here is why I was really interested in this I have on my A4 oh look huh? it's magnets that doesn't Feel like it's at all a magnet, but I'll use them on my fridge. We'll try to take the plastic off, see if that works. But let me show you. This is my A4, and you can see the switch right here. Whenever I'm using it and uh, I go and reach for something or adjust my diamond painting, anytime you get close to this, it's so sensitive. The light dims or it turns off. I have to reach underneath my diamond painting and turn it back on and it's really, you know, I'm not enjoying that anymore. <laughs> so I was looking to get away from that. This has a plug. It's still USB, but this is going to have a plug-in. And, oops, right here. On the switch. Oh my gosh. Sorry about that. Getting a little swingy there. Stop. There. On the switch is how you, it's still a stepless, stepless light,
but now there's going to be nowhere on the table that I can rub against it that will turn it off. I am very excited about that because honestly, after this amount of time, it's really getting on my last nerve every time that thing turns off. So a little USB cord. So let me open this up. And here's the cord coming out right over here. Oh. Oh, this is so big. I'm very excited. My understanding is that... Ooh, there's a piece of plastic in here, too. Um, my understanding is the A... This one is twice the size, and then the A2 would be twice the size of the A3. Why it goes... As you go down, it gets bigger and goes up. I don't know. That sounds really weird to me. Is there anything bigger than an, a, an A1? Is it an A0? Does it go negative? Not sure. But as you can see, it pretty much, it is kind of. I don't think it's exactly, but it's close to. It's a little, it's thicker too. You see that? It's thicker. And now it has the cord coming out because one of the things that people complain about the A4 is that um, the charging port that this will break. Now, I took some advice early on and I never touched that. I leave that plugged in and I unplug it from the wall. Um, so I never touch that. So I haven't had that problem. But this has this cord now. You don't have to, you don't have to worry about it at all. Plug this in here, plug this into my USB, plug it into the wall, and I'll be good to go. Let's see. It does have the scale around it, in case I ever do want to use it for something else. Let's plug it in and let's see. Okay, we're plugged in. Let's see. Oh, I just touched it. I just barely touched it. If I hold my thumb on it, oh yeah, it's hard for you to see, but it is getting bright. And then, turned off. Ooh, you don't have to hardly touch that. Perfect. I am very happy with this. So I will let you know. I think I'll do a whip and wine, and um, we'll try it out, right? Okay, so on to the next package. Wait, before we go, we have to try and see if it's a magnet, right? They gave me magnets. That is... Do not buy this and say, oh, great, it's a magnetic surface. This is not... This is going to hold nothing. <laughs> Maybe it'll hold a piece of paper. It does hold the piece of paper. I wouldn't trust it to hold anything here. Let's see. Here's a sticker. <gasps> Look at it making me a liar. Just trust me. It's real. Oh, you can't even see. Here you go. It is not a very strong magnet. That's not what I would purchase this for. That's not what I did purchase it for. That it was magnet. It was because of this. I looked and looked and looked. This is the only one I could find that had the that had the dimmer switch on the um, cord. Most of them are still on the board yet, even at this bigger size. And I thought, even even though it's a bigger size, and maybe I wouldn't hit it, I, that's not what I wanted again. So, okay, should we open up the diamond painting now? Here we go. Okay, on to the diamond painting. Uh. This is February, right? We have Valentine's Day, and there are some creators out there. They're working together. Um, I just wanted to let you know, in case you're looking to have a little Valentine's Day fun and diamond painting community, um, there's a 
Mindy's Diamond Moment and DP Addiction Adventure with Jennifer. Uh, I believe those two, they have a collaboration going for Valentine's Day. And um, Crafting Journey with Rebecca and GB Maltese, which is Grace. They're having a collaboration together um, for Valentine's Day. So just some Valentine's Day fun in the diamond painting community. Go check out those channels. Oh, I had a box in a box. Now I have a bag in a bag. Little Dr. Susie, isn't it? Yeah. I thought I'd join in the festivities and pull up a Valentine's themed painting for you all. I found this obviously on Amazon. Uh, I wanted to do Amazon so that you could you could actually get this painting if you like it. Um, one, you're never going to get anything out of China right now this quickly. And two, this one's a little different. Oops, I'm going to have to rip this paper off. It's stuck. Okay, so automatically I can see it does not have DMC. I really love DMC, but it's not a big deal. But, and if these are the symbols too. Holy cow. Clear as a bell, right? No problem there. It has 20 colors. It is a 30 by 40. 30 by, oh. You know what? I think right here, it's sticky all the way out here. So this is poured glue where the, they've gone too far on this end. The plastic covering, see the plastic covering comes all the way off over here and it's not, it's not covering it over here. So maybe I'll just relay the cover. I've never had to do that before. First time for everything. Ooh, snug as a bug. Uh, typical. Typical kit. Some baggies in there. I always think most places. Every once in a while you'll come across a company that gives you enough bags to actually kit up that way. But most of the time it's just this couple of bags. And I think, I wonder if that's for after storage is what they're giving you that for. Like, here's some bags to store any drills you might have left over. Because I don't, I don't understand it otherwise. I appreciate it, and after a while, after you get a couple of diamond paintings, you can collect them that way. Ooh, loving the pink. You know me, I love the pink. If you haven't seen um, Teeny Worlds of Wonder, she put out a video. I'm going to link it for you right here because... <laughs> She mentioned my love of pink in it. I appreciated that so greatly. That was so sweet of her. Thank you, Jessica. Um, you know who I also want to thank before we pull this out is Marissa at um, The Crafty Heifer. If you didn't catch last week, not last week, in the weekend before that, we had the, the Sparkle-a-thon, and she organized that. She invited me to take part in that. I had the best time. I was so nervous. I did a premiere because live just scares me half to death, but, um, oh, see, it's stuck on itself. Stuck, 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 stuck on itself. Ooh, I've never seen that before. It's not on the diamond painting, though, so I'm not really worried about it, but it is stuck on itself. Look at, though. Clean back. So, thank you to Marissa and the Crafty Heifer for such a wonderful event. I had the best time. It was great. I met a lot of great people, found a lot of content creators that I didn't know about. Um, so, yeah, she has the playlist. If you go to her channel on her playlist, she has the playlist. So, you can find all those wonderful creators that, you know, worked on that project. Okay, before I get into these drills, I want to do the drills so badly. And I have a shape. This is a 30 by 40. Do you want to see the image? Oh my gosh. That is pretty fairly... No, look it. You can see. Let me back up further. Look at that. 
It's a board picture. See the board picture? And then it has the heart. You can see love. The rose petals. The rose petals, when I look at it with the bare eye, are a little pixelated. But um, I don't think too bad. So long as you can see love, which you can. Isn't that cute? So I really wanted to find a diamond painting that wasn't a real typical... A typical image and I saw this and I thought this is just a little bit off the norm so that we could all have um you know a different option oh I really like it let's see what we can do about this paper that is oh my gosh look at here it's folded it's folded on itself normally I do this myself they've saved me the trouble and they've messed it up for me it folded over on itself See that? Okay. What do you think? Should we try and take it off and straighten it? I don't see what we have to lose. It's coming all the way off. Oh, it's awful. Holy cow. Okay. You know what? While we have it off, and hopefully I put that right side down. Let's see again without the shine on it. Can you see it even better? Oh, yeah. Isn't that pretty? So here, I'll draw you up close. I mean, clear as a bell, right? Clear as a bell. Clear as a day. Clear as a pond with a rock thrown in it. <laughs> you can see it. How's that? We'll just say it that way. You can see it. So this has squares on it. I used to be worried the first time... I saw that, I was worried about, oh, is it first quarter? No, it's just the color. So because it's a round drill, this adds to the color around the spaces. So, you know, when you put squares together, you get complete coverage. When you put rounds together, you do not. Uh-oh, look it up here, can you? I should put the plastic back on it before I get this stuck on something. <gasps> there it is, see right here? Yep, right there, there's a scratch. They scratched it. What are they doing? But right, it's just um, the spaces between the circles so that you can get continuous color. I'm going to check this now because I in no way trust myself that I... That is in fact the sound of the wrong way. <laughs> okay. Let's try again. Okay, this is the right way. Oh, did you see that coming? That didn't even get close. I was trying to reposition. Oh, what a mess this is. It is so sticky, too. I'm not really worried about it. If we took this stick down halfway, we'd still be doing a great job. Okay. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, almost. goodness you guys I might just have to edit that <laughs> unless I let you see this girl is nuts but I am just you saw I did not start this problem I want that noted other problems I have started myself this problem I did not start myself this problem was started for me and I am trying to fix it I want that on the record Let's try and do this whole thing. Because it's a little not all the way into the folds. Hey! Oops. Nope. Never mind. Don't. <laughs> I'm about to celebrate. Don't celebrate with me. We got a huge air pocket in the center here. Oh, this is tough. Slow and steady. Let's be the turtle, not the hare. Be the turtle, not the hare. Here we go. <gasps> We've got it. Coverage on top. Coverage on bottom. All sides. Ta-da. <laughs> okay, I do want to measure this. 
because this one, I'm pretty sure, um, I'll insert it right here. This is one of the paintings that did have a um, diagram on the listing that showed you that it was the correct size. And in fact, maybe I'm mistaken because this is a 35 by 25. and a 40 by 35. So none of it matches up. Who cares? It's super cute. It doesn't have, oh wait. It does have, D oh yes it does have DMC for the, I looked at these even, I said the cute pink. It does have DMC. It has an inventory sheet. I'll forgive you anything if you give me an inventory sheet. I'm pretty easy that way. Cute thumbnail on it. Nice inventory sheet. Okay. We have 20 colors. We do have oh, 14 bags of 310. Really? Oh, yeah. Look, it's in between, like, the cracks and things. That's not bad, though. I'm going to flip this over, and let's look at the drills. I love drills. Oh, look at how pretty she looks. I love this painting. Isn't it different? Okay, hold on. Okay, we do have a big string of 310. Here's a 938, which is a brown. Look at 152. Look at this pretty pink. Whoops. There, look at the pink. The camera is even saying, enough with the pink, lady. Can we move on from pink? No, we cannot. Look at this one, 3607. Does, I don't know if I know. Do I know 3607? Who cares? 3705? This is like a pink coral. I love coral. Okay, I'm going to speed you up through my inventory, and we'll see what we've got. Okay, so everything's all here, all 20 colors, all the packages that I need for them, complete inventory, perfect. And I really like these colors for this canvas. I, well, let's let's just look at the canvas, right? Here we go. There! Isn't, this is such a cute image. It's just a little bit different. I really like it. I'm interested to see how this turns out. Being that it is slightly pixelated, in these areas here even with um, the naked eye you can see that this is love so I'm not worried about that that's really what I was mostly worried about because honestly if you can't read the love you know the whole rest of it just falls apart on you right it just falls apart and how are the boards gonna turn out it looks real full of confetti so that usually means that usually means it's gonna turn out well and then no, oh, 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 I always forget this because I don't know why. Look, no guide circles. No guide circles. Okay. So even greater hopes. 
So we'll do a whip wine and uh, with this, and we'll see how it turns out. We'll try the, out the new um, A3 board, and hopefully that works, and that can be something that I can suggest to you. And I hope you all are having a wonderful February already. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in my next video.